Hello. Hello, my dear friends. Welcome back to Game of... Oh my god. <laughs> I almost said Game of Thrones. Why do I do that every time? Maybe it's just a habit. Welcome back to The Walking Dead. Yes, yeah, season one. Season uno, numero uno. Because we're playing all the seasons. Yes, we are. How are you guys doing today? Thank you for catching the stream. Thank you for watching on YouTube. I love all of you. You guys having a good day? Well, if not, I hope it gets better. And I hope you have a great week ahead. Yes, yes, yes. Well, we are on episode two of this game. Some crazy things happened out last time. If you don't remember, you haven't, if, or if you missed it, please head over to Michaela Faith YouTube channel. You'll find everything you want there and more to catch you all up. And if you want to see you know, faster, easier access to all of these unedited playthroughs live, head over and follow, follow me on Twitch at Michaela Faith. You'll find it all there. But we're on episode two, Starve for Help. I'm too invested in this game already. Too invested. Oh, that's right. So we're, so we're at the farm with these very suspicious people who Here came... Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. Yeah, I don't trust these guys. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The Take it easy, man. Them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and ash. 4,000 volts? I'm going to assume that's a lot. How do they still... Oh, I guess... Right, he said generator. They must have a very powerful generator. This is a really brilliant setup. Suits us just fine. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This I, here's I don't like Lee. Her. He moves around a lot, but things the way they are, maybe we can convince him to stick around for a while. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got oh my someone goodness. with survival experience to lead your group? We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's mm -hmm. good to hear. Yeah, just that so you know, if you ever try to attack us. Place. Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. Oh yeah, uh, I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. Why are you you're so interested, huh? We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? And yeah, don't forget We're our all friends incredibly back home. hungry. Mm -hmm. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk Can't and butter. Can't that sure. anymore. That's right. <laughs> Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this night or whatever <laughs> she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. Whoa, 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 We can help dude. you folks out. A vet? Oh, my. Our prayers have been answered. Maybe our whole group could come. For oh, the day. no. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? These why don't are I head back with the food and peeps. round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. No. See you in a while. Wait, no, Carly. I want you to stay. I love you, Carl's. Come Carl, on, Carly Lee, B. Yeah. Carly. Why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is these. incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Mark. Man, that fence. Mark. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Yo, Marky Mark. Let's make sure this place is safe. Before we yes. can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. There's right. no way. Obviously, they think it's safe. 
But is it safe enough for the kids? Yeah, I'm not risking Clem. broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. Yeah, so right. we can take I'll over. I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Yeah, I'm not trusting these people, okay? Like, that lady came out here with a stupid, stupid voice and accent that I'm not a fan of. She's like, hey, how you doing? I can't even do it. I can't even do it. <laughs> I just don't like it. I don't like it at all. I don't trust it. I gotta protect my family. We gotta protect the Clem. We gotta protect the Ken. We gotta protect the Duck. <laughs> Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> tour? I'll bet. Mind if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate oh, y'all helping out. Mama sure Looks does like appreciate y'all helping out. Mama see that. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. We're gonna fix the swing for the people. I love this game so far. It's really, really good. I love all the characters and everything. The storyline is really great. I'm not trusting these wet. <laughs> I won't say it. But I'm not trusting these guys, okay? I'm just not. They're, they're all very suspicious to me. The way that their accents are. <laughs> It's funny. I only suspicious you because you have the bad accent too. Look at this guy. Look at this Andy prick. <laughs> hmm. Pointy. It is pointy, yes. But it's cool that, um, you know, I'd just be playing this game by myself. I really appreciate you guys all watching with me. It's so much better playing for all of you. You know, because cause we're real lonely up here. Real lonely. <laughs> <laughs> Could be useful if I can find some boards to cut. Well, look no further. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. Great. Now you won't murder me, right? Because <laughs> that's what you guys don't do. <laughs> murder people? <laughs> Lure them into your house and murder them? Because <laughs> uh, you guys, you're the good guys, right? You guys are the good guys? Please? <laughs> we need to win here. Looks we need like to win. The fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. I'm sad because yep. our. Can't take any chances when it comes to safety. Our Mr. Glenn left us. Glenn left. But it's okay. He's with Rick. He's, he's Rick. Rick and Carl. <laughs> oh, no. God. Carl! Oh, no. <laughs> we should have a challenge. Who can say Carl just like Rick? And whoever gets the closest to that, um, I will give you a high five. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, we'll come up with an actual prize. Maybe we sh should we actually do that? You guys want to have a contest? Who can say Rick and Carl? No, just Carl, not Rick. The board Carl. Is good, but I need some rope. Okay, all right. Well, I just want to check something real quick. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're good. All right, so we need some rope. A ropey rope. A rope. Mark, Mark of Blyer. He's got the same glasses, black hair. Hey, 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 Mark of Blyer. So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I don't know. We've been here, been here for two seconds. The fence is no joke, at least around the house. I'm looking forward to seeing the rest of it. I'll keep looking around. I'm All looking right. forward keep me posted. to seeing the rest of it. Uh, shooby-doo, scooby -doo. Okay, I guess let's talk to big man, big man Teddy. Andy, whatever. Andy, Randy, Sandy, Landy. Hi. Commandy. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. 
I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stopped yes. by them, huh? Yeah, yeah, you asked me a lot of questions. You've scraped together a good supply in the last few months. How about yourselves? What kind of protection do you have around here? Only we, we get to... We collected a few mm. guns to protect ourselves, but we mm -hmm. really only use them when we go off the property. When we're inside right. the perimeter, the fence is all we need to keep us safe. Sure. Because these guys have been asking a lot of suspicious questions ever since they met up with us. First of all, the way that they just showed up at our doorstep and were like, Hey, we're looking for gas. We can offer you a home. It's like, uh, suspicious. And then they keep asking, like, who's the leader? How many people in your group do you have? Do you guys have a lot of weapons? Like, dude, can you be any more obvious? Um... Yeah, we we're. Be the first people mm, to yeah, yeah, yeah. The Where's everybody else? Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but mm -hmm. ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Bullshit. Why wouldn't they stay? You have such a safe, safe area here on this farm with a big ass fence that's protecting us from the walkers, and yet they don't want to stay? Sir? You were lying. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. You know? Like us. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. I'm gonna get to know the place for a minute. Okay, well, we gotta secure the perimeter, so don't take too long. Yeah, I'm, uh, getting real suspicious. What's that? Generator. <laughs> you guys come along with gas just in time. Yeah, so you guys have to get gas hey, uh, a lot, don't, don't mess you? with that, okay? The thing's a little tricky, and I don't want to spend half a day trying to fix it again. Mm-hmm. Don't trust you. I do not trust you. No. No trusty trust. No trust you. I do not. Do not a trusty. Okay. <laughs> no, we're gonna... We're gonna make sure that, uh, that you guys are, guys are good boys, but I don't think so. Hey, can I come on in? I gotta use the bathroom. Anybody? Can I, uh, use the bathroom? Ooh, shoe bucket. Is there a rope? We need a rope. Hey, we got ourselves some rope. Here this rope is, is some rope. For the swing. Let's go build it. I wanna build me a ropeity ropeity rope. Awards. Yeehaw! Awards for, you know, doing some rounding up and, uh, jumping with the horses and things and such. This dairy won a lot of ribbons in its day, huh? This place was my daddy's life. Holy hell. Meant everything to him. Just came you out know, of nowhere. when he first bought this place, it was a single-story house. Is that right? After us kids was born, he insisted on adding a second floor. Said they had to have room for as many babies as they could have. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Mama, right. she was done after Dan. Ah. My folks stopped after two as well. Then one day, the world changed. Now this place is all we have left of Daddy. Daddy. That's why we take such good care of it, and why we want to share it with good folks like yourselves. That's fair. Not really. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Okay, see you later. Yeah, bye. Okay. Literally, just... That was weird. He was He's way the hell over there by the generator. We make one comment about that, and he just comes right over, and he's like, Hey, yeah. Yeah, my daddy. This and that. Okay. Mm, See you later. Herbs. I can hardly wait for dinner. I don't know, Lee. I don't know. They might shoot us in the face before we can get to dinner, you know? Hey, knockity knock. Well. well hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away. Can in I the use kitchen. your bathroom? But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. Why is your face a different color from your chin and neck and things? Like, are you wearing foundation? Uh. No, like her face is pinker than the rest of her. Alright, how many rooms weird. does this house have? 
rooms? Like, look at it. <laughs> it looks custom built. Nice of you to notice. My husband put a lot of work into this old house. Where's your husband? Well, he did, did a you kill him? Fantastic job. I believe in making a house a home. Did you feast on his eyeballs? Your family's done an amazing job of keeping this place up. Well, now aren't you sweet? <laughs> Thank you, Lee. The boys and I have tried to adapt as best we can, but we still keep some of our old routines to help remind us of better times. Better times. Better times. Oh, you have a staff, eh? What happened to the rest of your staff? Oh, we've had our share of tragedy here. Just like everyone else, I'm sure. We ate them. Some of our <laughs> staff took off to find their family oh, soon okay, they sure. heard the news. The few that stuck around, well, we lost most of them the first night those things showed up here. It was oh, a tough night. Yeah, I don't, I don't believe your bullshit, lady. And I don't give a frick about dinner. Get out of here. Bye. Well, if anything comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. Well, also, the sun in the background. Appreciate it. Shut no up. Problem. The sun in the background looks really nice. I know, I'm being super mean to this family because I super don't trust them, like, at all. I think they're a bunch of fakey fakertons. I mean, can't you just tell how phony they are? Not only that, but, like, they keep asking way too many questions about our group. And they're just... W I don't know, man. Just something, something ain't right. Something ain't right. Let's all put right. up the fence. This shouldn't be too tough. All right, Lee, you got this. Well, I'll be damned. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully Mama. our kids will like it too. Yay! Did you say something, darling? Oh my goodness. Did you do that? Just trying to help out a bit around here. Do you, you have know, to like speak? I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. I. All fixed. That should make everyone happy. That should make everyone happy. Yeah, Duck is gonna lose his freaking mind when he sees that. Clementine will be like, ooh, this is nice. And Duck will be like, Aye! No. <laughs> okay, let's do the perimeter. Hi. Let's go. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark sure. and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Yeah, you never know if you're just gonna shoot us in the back of the head, eh? Gosh. In this world, you have to worry about the people more than the walkers, I swear. I mean, if Negan was any sort of indication, you know, or... So how's the place looking? Is the it governor. Safe for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but... Yeah. Let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. He wouldn't <laughs> be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. Yeah, you I, idiot. I'm, I'm sorry. All right. Freaking Markiplier. I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. There's one. Somebody tried to Ugh. shoot it. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for Ooh, target the sun purpose. in the background. Uh, I know I said that before, but wow. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. You gotta really appreciate the artwork on this game, like, right? Like, this game came out in 2012, guys. What is that, like, 10 years ago? My gosh, and it still looks great. We'll just take it out. Rip it. Yeah. Disgusting. Who do you think he was? Maybe a farmhand. I don't know. I hope he wasn't like this long before the fence finished him off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Hey, we still have our trusty axe. Let's name our axe. Let's name him. Come on. 
Axel! Sure oh my more. god, that's perfect. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Um... Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not gas. many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Um, hmm. What do you mean by that? Yeah. I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. Thanks, Thanks Markety Mark. There's Saint Marky one. Mark. I see it. Mark a blyer. Marky Marky Mark. Mark it a booty boo. <laughs> Gosh. Why do I do that with every name? I don't know. All right, Axel. Get him off. Ah. Bitch's grip is real hard. Man, the fence burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. It melted. All right, Axel. Time to do your job. Hoi! And round two. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Rampo. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Would have been nice to get some of those rations. I get hungry too, you know. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? I don't if know. If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Or maybe they're not expecting all of us to make it, you know? Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> that was a, some sick jump in there, Mark. Did you see that? Little help here, Lee? Nah, you can do it yourself. If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on. I, like, looked at it for two seconds. My God. Pushy, Mark. You're pushing me. You're giving me the push. <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck! Whoa. What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. <gasps> Whoa! Uh, what the? Uh, what the? Uh, get to the gate! March! Whoa! We can't get back on the other side. Jesus! He turned the gate back on. See? Something's wrong. Now you're Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on, that gate is our only way out! We had an agreement! Now you fuck! You assholes! Alright, maybe we should just move with the tractor. I can do this block block day. our barricade. It's too heavy? Damn it. Give us the food! Get out of here and face me like a man! <laughs> I can't see ya! Well, it looks like these guys have enemies, so that 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 that's not good. We're fighting somebody else's battles. What the hell? I thought I got it. I thought I. No, I don't understand why we to go. Oh, oh, oh! Get it, get it, get it, get it! Come on, Lee, let's go, Come let's on. go. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. Oh, shit. Ah, fuck you, All right, stay low, Mark. Stay low, Mo stay low, Marky Mark. Give us the food. Okay, I don't have the food. I don't have it. Aw, oh, shit. What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move it. Okay. No, leave me alone. This isn't our fight, dude. We're just visiting, bro. It's not us, man. It's really not. Hey, you're fighting the wrong people, dude. You're fighting the wrong people. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? Just two. Just two. Take it easy, Mark. You know, I don't see you pulling the weight, okay? Oh! Snap, crackle, pop. Uh, get off me, dude. Not today. Satan says no. Satan says no. He says 
Yeah. Uh, I think so. Come on. The gate's right there. Oh, there's a walker right behind us. Shit. Hey, hey, get off me. Get off me. I'm a good person. <gasps> oh. Oh. Um. That didn't go how we wanted it to go. <laughs> how many of those things? I love his shocked Pikachu face. You okay? He's just yeah. like, oh. Barely. Okay, let's try this again. The Round two. Right there. Give us the food. Give us the food. Ooh, thanks, guys. Did me a favor there. Appreciate it, pal. Let's get out of here. Cool. You lucky sons of bitches. Go ahead and run. We ain't going nowhere. We ain't going nowhere. Well, okay. Hey, uh, you guys have some enemies over there. Thanks for turning, doing that, whatever you did with the gate, helping us Lee, out there. What's wrong? Uh, uh, there was a goddamn ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? Bandits? Doesn't here? look like okay. On I have a freaking arrow oh in the shoulder. Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, where did- I should just- Hey, welcome, welcome to the party, oh, everyone. No, honey, come on. Super Brita safe here. <laughs> they walk up we'll and see <laughs> Mark has a freaking arrow in his what? shoulder. Must be the what kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, it doesn't really it. seem like Carly it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. Maybe it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Wait, what? Pandas? Why is are what? you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need mm -hmm. to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, oh call your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's you ben are very charming. Well, Since thank Carly you so and much. Ben ate some of the food Thanks on the way for the to get follow, us. man. She volunteered Woo! to stay behind Love and watch you. the motor in until we get back. <laughs> Thanks for hey, watching. Kids, look what Lee got working for you. Got the got the swing. swing. Yeah, Clemmy. Like Just a duck's gonna lose his shit. Duck is gonna lose his shit. Thanks, Lee. You're the best. Yeah. See, we're such a good dad. Oh my gosh. Let's go I want to say hello to the Clemmy Clue. See, I knew I knew Duck was going to take that. I knew it. Clementine, how hey, are Clem, you, girl? Do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Thanks for fixing it. You're welcome. Will you push me on it? Yes, 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 yes. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Alright, don't be a butthole. Yeah, yeah, Duck. Duck is such a character. He's cr he's so funny. He always goes for it. How are you doing, baby boo? Are you boo? up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm yeah. just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? Oh yeah, St. Marky yeah, Mark got an arrow in his shoulder. Worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Uh, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. 
Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Does seem pretty do normal, doesn't it, Clem? Ever get back to how they were? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to lie to her. So. I hope so too. Don't worry, we're safe here now. For now, for now. I still don't trust these guys. Too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Of course. You're welcome, it's sweet all pea. Yours. All right, yeah. duck. There you go, duck. Okay, all duck, right, don't duck. Don't pop a gasket. <laughs> Even his dad's like, chill, dude. Kenny, he's pushing that swing like nobody's business. <laughs> okay. All right, watch out. Don't want to get kicked in the face. Okay. There we go. Kenny. Ken is our best hey, friend. Haley, found anything interesting? I was talking to Andy a bit earlier. Doesn't sound like they have too many guns around. They rely mostly on the fence to keep them safe. So mm. long as you're on this side, things are all right. Provided the fence holds out. Well, that's the problem. When there's no more gas, there's no more fence. That's true. Well, it's good to know what we're working with here. Keep looking around, and let me know if you find anything else. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? No, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Uh, if He's hungry. If works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. I, I don't right. know. Duck and Clementine deserve a better life than starving to death at some crappy motel. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? Yeah, Lily, Lily is already suspicious. Um, and we don't like Lily. I mean, well, Lily's okay. Larry is the douchebag. I guess, uh... Lily isn't too thrilled about being here. I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Ooh, Duck and Katja need food. And I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch him go hungry. You're with me on this, right? Mm, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lily's judgment is clouded, but you got a pretty clear head about these things. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever yeah but that is true see what that's very out. suspicious because why why are these bandits so pissed at them huh huh something ain't right but yeah let's go to the bandits I guess we have to go up there to do that I just want to quickly uh, quickly see what else is around here it just seems too good to be true these guys you can definitely tell they built this thing themselves Oh, we can go out. Oh, we can explore. Yeah, I agree. Lily is always Oh, there they are. We'll probably talk to them in a second. Lily's super paranoid Looks like a all the time. Station for the cow. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're going to need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Gonna have to learn how to maintain it. Alright, let's talk to the... Hey, I thought you guys were supposed to be going to making friends. Where's that charm, Larry? Yeah. Fool. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you really? think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. I mean, it was your shoulder. Yeah, so it's, it's not, not too bad. bad. Oh, will be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. Thank you for your How input. How could you all bring us to this place? <laughs> about your dad. Yeah, I don't like him. <laughs> How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. Yeah, you know, you just take an arrow to the knee and you're no <laughs> you can no longer do anything about it. I uh, take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything. But gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid, if you ask me. Okay. Lee, I know you and Kenny are friends, but you recognize that he's not the right person to lead this group, don't you? 
Uh, Kenny believes there's still hope. Maybe that's what we need right now. Well, hope doesn't do any good if we're all dead. I'm focused on keeping us alive. Okay. Okay. See, this is why I don't like Lily running things. And Larry? Gosh. I also don't like you either. Just, I just want to tell you that. You suck. Okay. Bye. No, Lily, I think Kenny would probably, I mean, he's been taking the position of leader this entire time that we've been together. Like, just saying. Ooh, is there some sneaky sneaky? Something sketchy in there? If room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in ships. If there's not oh, enough son room of a in the house for all of us, <laughs> I guess a few of us could camp out here in ships. Well, why is it a hand? Okay. Well, it's a pretty big house. I think we could all fit in there. But are they going to let us stay in their house? I mean, we're strangers. Lots of hay. I don't know. Ugh, look at <laughs> look at Duck in the back. <laughs> if that becomes a problem. Kenny's just like, Ugh, trying to push his son for 20 minutes now. Ugh. And Duck's like, more, Dad, more! Duck is just silly. I like Duck. He's a silly little boy. He can be a little annoying sometimes, but that's fine. Alright, we already looked at the generator and did all this stuff. I say let's just go to the bandits. Let's go. Hopefully Clementine will be okay while we're gone. Kenny will watch her, right? Fellas. How you feel, Fellas. Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Yeah, it's your fault, you jerky jerk told face. You how dangerous it was. The hell? No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? <sighs> just something... I, just why do they expect us to to fight their battles for them? Is that just me? Like, are you? is this you offering that we're going to be able to stay here? Because then I'll help you. But not any second sooner. Yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Sure, I guess. Clemmy! She needs her hat back. Are you going now? Yeah. yeah. I'll be back soon, Clementine. Stay near Ken, Ken. Lucky. I will. You, you stay near the duck, duckster meister. See anything? Not yet. Dun dun. dun I know dun, it's dun. around here. It's gotta be close. Hmm. Some soup cans. Hmm. Here. Oh shit. You found it? All right, buddy. Stealth mode. We're going stealth mode. Are we going to shoot some people? Looks deserted. You see anybody? Mm, st yeah, stay on your guard. Stay on your guard. You never know. Might be somebody hiding hiding Watch in a corner. My back, Lee. I'm going to check out the tent. Okay, sh 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 keep it down. Keep it down. Uh, easy, pal. Easy does it. Careful. Eh? Ah. Disappointed! Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Hmm. 
Well, okay, I guess it's empty, but where are all the bandits? Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these. Recently. Yeah, they must be around here somewhere. They hide they hide in somewhere. Nothing but fumes. Shit. Why is that bad? Is that bad? What's in the boxes? They're all from What's in the box? The first oh, what's in the box? Last few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? <laughs> Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. Do, do, do. I'll pass. I'll pass. Whoa, your dairy farm box. Hey, hey. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Did they or did you? Yeah, are we on the right side here? We don't even know. Whose side are you on? Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Mm, suspicioso. Suspici. Look at this lawn chair. It's a nice, that's Looks a nice like chair. To be here <laughs> empty. Empty, 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 empty. What's that? Ooh. Looks like a detonator. Is there a bomb? Oh, it's a, oh, it's a camera. He. What do you find? A video camera. Does it work? Let me see that. No. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. Good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find. See the way he freaking reacts. Table. What? First he's like, uh, le uh, video camera. Uh, let me see. I it. see you handled oh. that gun. I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, right. You did say she was running things for you. Sounds like you picked a good leader. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you asked too many questions, pal. I don't like it. I don't. Yuck. I don't need that. <laughs> Yuck. What's in the crate? More milk? Nothing. Bunch of nothing. Okay, let's go in the tent. See anything? Anything useful? Anything at all? Aw. 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 There's a little girl. Where's her mom? Dad, they were obviously staying here. Jesus, is a kid mixed up in this? Isn't there always? Was more like. Was more like. Oh man. Wait, let's take the bunny back. If they're not coming back, maybe Clementine will want it. No. We'll say it. <gasps> Whoa. The hell? Do we fucking move? Oh. Shit! Shit! Put your guns down. It's a lady. I'm going back. It's a lady you with some tell crazy hair. Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the what? fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are, and I know Ooh. what you do. You Ooh. don't know me. You steal my shit. Steal everything from me. What we happened? We had a deal. You people broke it first. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? And well, why does your hair look like question, Mrs. Mister. Frankenstein? They told me I'd be safe with them. Men who lived here. But it weren't safe. Not for me. Not for my girl. When they was the last time you had nice. a brush? Not at all. <laughs> he took her away into the woods. Oh, no. Wouldn't tell me where. And I begged them her? every way I could think. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed them. And I'm staying here till she comes back to me. One way or another. She'll come back. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down! To you be fair, I there's two guns you? on you. I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice, sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. What? All men are monsters. 
take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? Yeah. A little girl. Yeah. You stole it from her. Where'd you get so it? What if I did? You stole her from me. Wait, what? What do you mean? What are you talking about? Why is what she acting the hell like are you she, talking yeah, about? Yeah, why is she acting like she knows Clementine? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Okay, yeah, okay, right whoa, through. whoa. String him up on that tree. Then I'm gonna take it easy. Farm and shoot every Just goddamn person put I it see. down. Put, put it down. down. The crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> She is just insane Go in the on. brain. Tell him, boy. Jolene. Tell him what you got in mind. For oh. 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 Um. Wait. God she, damn it. Uh. You just shot her. You straight up murdered that woman. Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. Actually, pointed at my forehead. Why is she wearing a uniform? One and two. She, you killed her right before she was about to reveal something it's about shot, you. Though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. And no empathy. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. This dude's a little psycho in the brain, isn't he? So the dude's a little crazy. He just... Sh I mean, he's got no remorse. Look at him. Smiling. Hmm. Come on. I can't remember the last time Lee killed someone and smiled. Or maybe he smiled when he killed his uh, ex-wife's, you know, cheater. <laughs> I still find that crazy that Lee murdered somebody before the whole apocalypse went down. It's like, wait, what? Hey guys, we're back. We're back Man, in black. That was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't Jesus. getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handle You're it, back. Mama. We had to kill somebody. Is dinner ready? How's it? Who's a he's a? This isn't I'm what country. Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. My face is a different color than my whole rest then of my body. for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. Oh no, they're fighting again. Gosh, it's the same old song and dance. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling, looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? What's going on with your face? Uh, don't mind them. It's how they are. Yeah, we don't want to Each let them know that charge, our group you know? is in shambles. Well, we don't need they don't need to know that. Just the hunger talking. We all get a little testy. We'll fix that shortly. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. Lee? I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. She has a crazy look in her eye. Bring Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Yeah, pretty handy that we happen to have a veterinarian for your cow. For your cow. You're welcome. Sounds like it's gonna rain like a thunderstorm. Clemmy, I found your hat. I found it. I found your. Ha I found the hat. I'm so happy that we found her daddy's hat. It's it's the epitome of Clementine. She can't have without the hat. Well, okay, guys. I'm going to end this stream here and this pot here. Thank you so much, Jay, for watching. Thank you for following me. I do have a YouTube channel where I play a lot of other games. And if you happen to miss any of the previous parts, you can head over there. Michaela Faith YouTube channel. The link is in uh, on my profile there. You can find that there. And please subscribe. If you enjoyed this video... Please hit that like button and hit that notification bell to let you know when a new video comes out. Yes. And follow me on Twitch for all unedited playthroughs live and join the chat room. It's so much fun. But yes, this game is amazing. I'm super excited to continue playing to see where this whole milkman business ends up to see if we can trust these guys. I don't think so. They seem there's so many red flags that are popping up. And even though I haven't played this game in a long time, I just don't remember exactly how everything goes down. 
so we will see. Just as long as Clementine, Kenny, Duck, and Katja are safe, those are our main fam bam. We want to keep them safe as much as we can. Everybody else, meh, 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 meh. <laughs> so I'll catch you all in the next video. Good and bye. Peace. Catch you in the next one.